Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Real Hazardous. We are out here, first fishing trip of 2023. Excited to finally get out. It's been a while, but I've had some great hunts, some other inshore trips. But uh, now we're out here chasing some wahoo and tuna and probably drop down and catch some bottom fish. So uh, looking forward to having a fun day. We got Alton and Leon, who we actually went hunting with. Remember that big deer I killed that was with them? My dad, we got Kayla out here at the ledge for the first time. So hopefully we can put them on some good fish. Here we go. All right guys, we're gonna get our gear out and start fishing. Okay, so what we'll do is once we get close, you'll pick it up and then you'll walk back a little bit and okay. I'm going to hand you the weight and uh, you can back off the drag a little when, when, you, when I hand you the weight and I'm going to lead him in and for some reason he runs, you know, just be ready to just drop the weight and let him run. Oh uh, wait, I think that's a mahi. I see green. Um, yeah. Okay. Can you grab that scale? Alright. Where would he go? There we go. Yeah, that's a big mahi. That was a good one. This mahi was pretty cool. Um, something hit it. You know, we heard like a little, you know, like just a pull it maybe six, seven feet looking at the wax thread, my marking. And I'm like, well, dang, fish hit it. Weren't sure, wasn't sure what it was. I was like, I'll keep pulling. And uh, about the time I was going to tell my dad to reel it up, check it, um, we saw the fish kind of hit it, kind of came out of the water a little bit, couldn't tell what it was. So um, I actually, you know, when he kind of hit it, I sped the boat up, basically setting the hook. And uh, we got the fish on, got it up. I was thinking amberjack, the way it kind of hit, kind of kind of softer strike. When we get up, I can see green, it was a nice bite. So that was really, really nice surprise. Sometimes when you're trolling, it's, um, you know, pay attention and, and just use the boat, you know, especially high speed trolling, uh, to set the hook. You know, if the fish is grabbing, once he does grab it, you know, give it a little gas and that'll set the hook. We're not, we're not gonna be jerking on it. That's not really gonna do much in this scenario. So keep that tip in mind. Hi right, guys, I'm fixing to show you how to catch a fish. I'm going down with the right bait. Just want to pull up a good fish. Alrighty guys, nice calm day. Let's see if we can catch some bottom fish real quick. Oh, dang. I don't know, it took a little drag. So it must have been a pretty decent bite. You got tree? Yes, this area looks so look, uh oh. <laughs> this area is looking pretty good. Pretty good marking. Mark it? Yeah, I marked it. You getting any progress on them or? Yeah. Okay. Pretty good fish. No, it's not short. Ah, uh, Amberjack. Pull him in. That's not a regular, that's not the amateur, that's the uh, uh Almaco or yeah, what? Almaco, I think. Are they any good? Yeah. Thanks, Martin. Um, I think so. Yeah, there's one of them that's good. There we go. That's a good one. Right in the corner of the mouth. Just watch right to catch him. Yeah. 
<laughs> you picked your shot. Get ahead here more. Seven more trying to get my bait. Yeah, we have much of a drift or no? It's not bad. A lot of good stuff looks like down there. There we go. Got one on there. Oh, oh there we go. Might be a trigger there. That or more. It'll be a long way if you don't start cooperating with your fish. They're waiting on you guys. I see fish. Can I call them or what? Take this out, guys. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. There's no margin. There's actually some up high. May get bites at 120 feet versus the 180 feet we're in. Still there? Yeah. I think you could make a bell out of these uh, trigger fish. Oh, you see them down there yet, Gila? I just seen them. Yeah. What kind of fish? Maybe oh, trigger? Yeah. Another fat boy? There are more fish There we go. I guess. <laughs> Why aren't y'all doing this to begin with? Nope. You got double trigger? Yeah. Dang, that's not bad. Nice. Get them and go. Oh man, that one is huge. Look at the size of that one. <laughs> Put that on our to-do list. Yeah. Wow. Oh, that is huge. That's the ones we want, guys. These, these right here. We need to do some work on this rod. <laughs> Take take this one. This is the new one. Yeah, you take it. Yeah, as soon as it hits the bottom, though, you go. What's tougher, the mahi or the trigger? <laughs> that mahi. Pretty rough. Don't cut that weight, but this is this is fun up here. It's only a uh, hundred more feet to go. That's close. I see color. Oh yeah. Another trigger. It's a big trigger. Bring them in, guys. Bring them in. Uh, Let me do that from under because I'm. I got one on too. Guys, you can only get fifty though. Thank you. If you get need 50, a hand. I'm happy. You ready? Yeah. So I do one drag and then. These are powerful fish, guys. Feels so big. Oh, well, it probably is once you get it up. Right now, it's a little trigger. <laughs> yeah, only about a little. Like it's big. Oh, it's not bad. Not bad. I thought it might be a little bigger. Ouch. Okay. Yeah, I hope that picked up well. Can you swallow it? Yeah, You hooked up again, Kit? Oh, dang. Yeah, big boy. Jeez. Hey. A lot smoother. Yeah. Dang. Alright, these guys are loading up. That was a nice. Oh yeah, trigger. Alright, click click yours in the boat. <laughs> I got this one. You got it? Yeah. Move back and wipe it. Where's the grass? Uh, can't. Oh, you can't start feeding. I think it's this. 
that the right one? Uh, yeah, I think it's just one more. I can't tell which way though. Are you ready? Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna find get another one in my hood. Hold on, somebody give me a something to cut this hook out. Get no lean. Are you still on there? You got one on, Jeremy? I'm not sure, I'm just trying to. How'd you do it, JJ? Let me get a piece of the line and I'll just take care of it. All right. All right. Okay. Uh, uh, all right, so we're out here fishing once again, me and JJ. Show them what you've done there, JJ. There's no handiwork right there. Actually, the trigger did it. Oh, get him in there, Dad. Yeah. Uh, so this is the second time that me and JJ's been in this situation. Yeah, one, once in uh, Venice, Louisiana, tuna fishing, and now here out of Jacksonville. So we're going to see if we can get him fixed up here. That one out? Okay, so we're going to get back to fishing here in just a minute. I'll get JJ fixed up here where we can uh, get back at it. Yeah, I'm going to count to three. All right, how about that? You are the man. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought I was going to rinse it off here a little bit. Keep going down. Yeah, I will. Uh, okay. Uh, all right, so this is hook number two that I've gotten out of JJ's fingers. Yeah. So. I'm if bleeding profusely. Profusely. We're going to do a whole series just on my finger, can you? <laughs> Don't we have a um, band aid in there? Or we have some tape or something I can just tape it with? We should. I know we got duct tape and we got a first aid thing in there. Um, All right, guys. It's a nice, beautiful day, which is a nice change. Fish or no fish. Having a nice day in the water is great. We had to go through some fog to get here, but it's pretty now. It's actually really warm for uh, January, even out here. How far up are you reeling? I, I didn't think I ever even got to the bottom on that one. Oh, uh, um, I got one too. Uh, uh, these are strong, powerful fish, guys. These trigger fish are very strong. And we're in deep water. So you gotta fight him a long ways up. I think I see mine. I think he's just now coming up. This is a triple hook rig. I didn't realize that. Trigger. Uh, not as big as some of the big ones, but uh, he's pretty solid. Hey, Kayla, like dolphins. A bunch of dolphin jumping. Big school of porpoise. No. I thought it might have been tuna at first. I got excited. They were all busting. Got him. Uh oh. All right, Kayla, you got it. Dang. Then, then out and get two keepers too. What's that? He got two too, right? All right, guys, uh, trolling slow, but uh, trigger fish bite has been insane. It's been a really great, um, one of the best triggers we've had in a while. Got something. I'm not sure what. It doesn't quite feel like a trigger fish, but we'll see. Oh yeah, it's a. A squirrel fish. Nah, uh, well, just a little. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, that's a wrap for today. Had a great day catching triggers. Really good day on the triggers. Got a mahi and a lot of fun fish. And just a beautiful day in general. Enjoyed fishing with Leon and Alton today. Of course, my dad, Kayla behind the camera, and myself. Really yeah. appreciate you guys. We appreciate it. We had a really good time. Uh, here it is, January 2nd. Beautiful day. I know I'm dressed in coveralls, but we're getting ready to run back to the boat ramp, so I'm trying to stay a little warm once we do, uh, start heading back. But uh, just what was about a month ago, you guys were up in Georgia, yeah. and you killed you a good, oh, yeah. a good buck. Uh, what was it, nine point, uh, eleven point? Eleven point, yeah. Yeah, I tried to shortchange you a little bit. <laughs> killed you eleven point, and then uh, we come down here today. We caught one 
mahi, boatload of triggers. So really had a good time. We was going after Wahoo, didn't work out, but we did catch a boatload of fish. Yes, so sir. we're good. Yeah. We appreciate everything. Mm -hmm. Tune in for another edition of Cat and Hook. <laughs> yep, yep. You got a hook again. <laughs> another hook. I think this is a magnet, a hook magnet that right hand. <laughs> got a bow at one time too, so. Yeah, for anybody that watched the uh, Venice trip, pulled a hook out of JJ's hand then, yeah. and another one today. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we made, we do. Yeah, so this is part two. Yeah. yeah. Well, thanks for watching the videos. Uh, look forward to the next one and a whole new year full of fishing. So we'll see you on the next one.